It's heavy, man. I got all my, all my witchy things in there. Oh my gosh, I just pulled muscles. <laughs> My name is Ashley Shoesmith and I'm Tatum Shoesmith and we are Shoes Shoes. You know the vibes. You know the vibes. <laughs> I need to throw this trash. <laughs> it's so chaotic. All right, in today's video, we're gonna switch it up a little bit. Instead of it being more towards like Korean things, we are going to show you another side of us, our witchy side. Witchy side. Mm -hmm. We've we've been getting really into tarot reading. We like incense, crystals. Like talking to spirits in general that we're yeah. kind of interested. We'll show in. you what we use, how we go about like spells. Yep. What kind of witches we are because we are different witches. Um, so we thought, what a better place to do it than in nature. Yeah. Yeah. We got oh. our coffee. Yeah. We got coffee. Oh, my gosh, so good. As much as like some of the other stuff we tried in the in the video. We were gonna light incense, but we forgot a lighter. So, we're smart. Is there anything we can make a fire with? Like a rock and a, get some sparks going? We're out of nature, We're going to be real witches here. Create a fire in the middle of the forest. You see us on the news and we burnt down the whole park. <laughs> <laughs> there were these witches! They were crazy! <laughs> Talking to a camera. So first we'll show you our tarot cards. Because we both have that in common where we use tarot cards but we use very different ones currently. Yep. So mine is, the, this is the first one I got. They're and like we, pretty and simple. And we got into tarot reading how long ago? Like a year? I think it's been al almost a year now, yeah. So this is the deck I picked out. We'd been talking about getting tarot cards for a while because we both were into witchy things. And we're like, one of these times we have to, because we live in a small town, so we had to drive somewhere to get them. Yeah. I'm like, one of these times we have to make it a girl's trip and go get them. And we went to a Barnes and Noble and we were looking around and we literally spent half an hour trying to find the tarot card section. Yeah. That was embarrassing. But once we found it, we were in heaven. <laughs> I, th I think we searched for our tarot cards for like 20 minutes. We did. Because we did. there were so many options. And then finally, we're like, these are the ones. So this is my oracle deck, which for, if you don't really understand the difference between tarot and oracle, oracle is just like more specific. This one's moonology. So it has like the moon phases on it and how like the moon can affect how you feel, what you do, how you think, stuff like that. So like this one has the moon in like a picture but then it also says you're good enough and then it tells like the moon, what kind of moon, so full moon and Virgo. I don't know, I just thought that was interesting. It's kind of nice to use when you're more lazy. <laughs> and you're like, I don't really want to interpret fully. Now let me tell you, that deck has some attitude and spice to it because it's hit me where it really hurts. <laughs> yeah. She's very blunt. <laughs> yeah. This one is my Oracle deck. It's animal spirits and the back of the cards just have this like scaly design and then that's the illustrations very pretty artwork moon one is more I think it's orange. it is yeah. it's not a bee ray no it's orange. <laughs> <laughs> uh, my moonology ones are more like internal struggles like 
that's why she said they kind of hit you so hard because <laughs> they, it kind of calls you out on stuff that you don't want to say out loud. I was loud. trying to keep that berry down in my soul. What do you mean? <laughs> don't talk to me like that. <laughs> I'm not ready to let that yeah. out. <laughs> my zodiac sign is I'm a December Sagittarius. And I'm a December Capricorn. So we're, we have close birthdays. Fire sign. Earth sign. Libras. <gasps> spider. Either. It's fine. I'm so glad that wasn't my hand, bro. I would have accidentally punched you, I think. It was. <laughs> well, it was really, really tiny. Other. <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> it's fine. It's only been like five minutes, bugs, please. So I'm. It's actually kind of cool because I'm the lunar apprentice and Ashley is the solar apprentice. So w once we found out, we're like, well, we're like yin and yang. Mm -hmm. And we kind of called each other that before we found that out. Since I'm the uh, lunar apprentice, it goes along with like uh, dream analysis and understanding dreams well. So a lot of the times I'll get messages through dreams, which it sounds kind of stupid if you're not like into this witchy stuff, you're like, sure you do. But I mean, you kind of just have to go down your own path with it. I also didn't realize that people couldn't control their dreams. I know, we're sitting there having our coffee. Oh, her, her dreaming got brought up, and then I'm like, dude, did you know that some people can like, um, control their dreams? Like can, what, it, what is it called? Lucid dreaming. Lucid dreaming. Yeah. And I'm like, I can't do that, but that sounds cool. And she's like, what do you mean? I'm like, when somebody can control their dreams and like, knows that they're in a dream. And she's like, doesn't everybody do that? Yeah. I'm like, I was just like no. Yeah. Hold up. Hold up. Sounds better. What are sensible. my abilities? <laughs> I consider myself some sort of an empath, I guess. But Most witches are. I think that's like a general yeah, power. Yeah. Just because you feel more like connected to people and have a better understanding. Oh, we have very good intuition too. Yeah. Like when we can tell straight up when someone is like a bad vibe not saying necessarily that they're like a bad person but maybe you just can tell that you're not gonna get along with that kind of person yeah then you can kind of get that vibe from it they might be a fine person but like they don't belong in your life to our other witch stuff we have a bunch of jewelry I, one. I like wear mine all the time because I just feel more connected to it that way just kind of feels like protection and help I got these and she got those when we were in Cancun I these I got to symbolize the seven chakras hmm. and then this one's just dry and makes me feel cool you know and then I also have this one right here it says two different stones in it lucky too because it's a lucky cat and it makes then, me happy every time I see it I know it's so <laughs> normal because we have a coven I don't know if we've said this before we have a coven um, we have four of us. Yeah. Which is Ashley and Sole from our other videos. <laughs> so I got this uh, necklace. It's the throat chakra. She wears it on her wrist because she doesn't listen to no one. Yeah. I do what I want. <laughs> it's and a this little bracelet has a necklace too. <laughs> <laughs> Why? Why do you keep looking behind me? Because there's a car. Oh. <laughs> That's awkward. <laughs> so we also got these in Cancun. This is the same stone as that first bracelet and you know how we were saying we're yin and yang like she's the lunar and i'm a solar apprentice she ha she got these that match a necklace and a bracelet and i got mine in moonstone, like right? a moonstone necklace and bracelet i also got this rose quartz one i feel like witches are just kind of accepting yeah of weird people right so. i can show you my my stones, stones. my crystals yeah. <laughs> this, oh, oh, it's shining. It's breaking. This is my so pretty clear quartz geode. I think that's how you pronounce it. Kiwiyoyoyo. That's Kui what yo I. <laughs> Kiwiyoyo. Yo. It's so cute. It's the first stone that Sole gave me. It's an amethyst. Yeah. She both. She gave us both her first stones. I got these recently on our witch trip. And I kind of like it because it's kind of, I have four, like, crystal stones right now. So I feel like I have all four elements. 
Like this one's earth, fire, water, and then my other one's air. So, yeah. And I don't know the names of all of them. I'm going to be honest with you. And we're trying to learn Korean. We can't memorize everything. These. I have a lot more. I'm not going to show you every one, but I'll show you the ones that I meditate with. I think selenite. This is black um, tourma tourmaline, tourmaline, something like that. This is the clear quartz. This is uh, pink quartz, rose quartz, whatever. And then amethyst. This whole bag of little ones that I don't like put on display as often. I just put like my bigger ones. Wait, that thing is like full. Yeah. Can you see? Mm -hmm. Most of these I got as a kid and I forgot I had. And I got them from the Smithsonian Institution when I went there as a kid. I want to steal this. <laughs> but I won't. And then something that I can show you next that I kind of just got into is my pendulum. Pendulum, whatever, however you say it. And I got this board to go with it. Fancy. So, we, I don't know, maybe we should try contacting somebody. Alright, if there's a kind spirit, it's already spinning. If there's a kind spirit that would like to talk to us today, can you please show us yes? Thank you. And then, can you please show us no? I'm telling you, it works every time. Thank you. Is this the same spirit guide that I was trying to contact earlier this week? Sorry, it's windy out, so it might be hard for you to respond. Is this the same spirit that I was trying... Why is it again? It's really it's so windy, windy right now, sudden. bro. There was a car there the whole time and I did not notice. Where? There was a van. Where? Just that just they left. out? Yeah. The fact that we didn't hear it come in and then that was kind of weird. That's a little creepy. Alright, spirit, can you please tell me, are you the spirit I was contacting earlier this week? Yes. Oh my gosh, that was the strongest. Thank you. Did you, do you like the outdoors? No. No? <laughs> That's funny. Are you a homebody? <laughs> yes. You're a homebody. Thank you. Look at how it's magnetizing to, you missed it! It was so strong, bro. Oh my god, it's doing it! It does it every time I See that? All right. Um, sorry for freaking out, spirit. I'm gonna say goodbye right now because I'm losing feeling in my foot <laughs> for some reason. <laughs> goodbye. Thank you. Bye. Thank you. And that means goodbye, camera. That when it spins like that, or it's searching That's for another solid. spirit. Look at it. Oh my gosh. Thank you. Isn't that crazy, bro? Isn't that absolutely crazy? Because when things happen, you have to remember them for like certain readings that are special. So we both have our journals, so writing down our like experiences and stuff. Mm -hmm. Those are some things, our tools for our witchy side.